okay let us sit comfortably sukhasana padmasana ardha padmasana whichever is comfortable for you roll your shoulders make your spine erect palms open to the ceiling eyes closed take few deep breaths inhale deeply and exhale slowly inhale the vital energy and exhale relax take one more long deep breath in and breathe out slowly and completely now let us chant om three times bringing your fingers to chin mudra breathe in for om om Oh. So we join the bonds together. Oh, Sahana, come with you. Sahana, come with you. सह वीर करवाहै तेजस्वीनावदीतमस्तुमाशाबै and looking through the gaps of the fingers open your eyes with a beautiful smile okay so today we will do uh, three stage pranayama so for which we can sit in vajrasana okay or you can continue to sit in sukhasana also so what we do here is first sitting in vajrasana we keep our hands palms facing downwards okay palms facing downward and keep our hands like this on the hip okay now we take deep breath just like how we breathe in ujjayi breathe in ujjayi and breathe out so we will do it with a count we'll do it with a count of 6 4 6 4 six is for inhalation holding for a count of 4 and exhalation for a count of 6 and again external retention 4 okay then the, this we here we will be concentrating on the abdominal breathing so whenever we are breathing out our tummy goes out and whenever we are breathing out tummy goes in okay the, the second stage what we will do is keep our hands inside our armpit i mean like uh, thumb will be inside the armpit at this shoulder level we will keep our hands here we concentrate on chest breathing and we will continue the same count and do that the third stage we will keep our hands behind our shoulder blades like this our elbows will be pointed upward okay and here we will be breathing in ujjayi but we will be concentrating on the thoracic area more okay so this is third stage three stage pranayama first is abdominal breathing second is chest breathing and thoracic breathing okay yeah only our concentration will differ where we will concentrate on the abdomen concentrate on the chest and the concentrate on the 
thoracic region while we are doing the breathing in. But we will be doing the breathing in in Ujjayi only. Okay? Yes? So let us keep our hands. Thumb will be behind our hip and four, four fingers will be pointed forward and back. You can, you can do the same thing with your seated condition also. Okay? Yeah. Now breathe in Ujjayi for a count of six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Breathe out. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Now we will go to the second stage. Here you have to concentrate on chest breathing. Anyway, your abdomen also will come out when you are breathing in. Abdomen will go down when you are breathing out. So bring your hands and thumb will go behind inside the armpit and all the four fingers will be pointed towards. So whenever you are breathing in, your chest will expand and your hands will move slightly outward like this. Okay? Yeah. Breathe in. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Now release your hands. 
Now we will go to the third stage. Here we take our hands and keep it behind our shoulder blades. Okay? Right hand behind your right shoulder blade. Left hand be behind your left shoulder blade. And our elbows will be pointed upwards. Now we do the same thing. Concentrate here and do the thoracic breathing. It includes automatically abdominal plus chest. Then the thoracic region. Okay? So breathe in. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Inhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold. One, two, three, four. And slowly release your hands and relax your legs. Sit comfortably. Relax. So this is 33 stage pranayama. It's nothing but it is also called as yogic breathing. In yogic breathing, what we do is first we will concentrate only on our abdomen. So when you're breathing, you, breathing in, your tummy goes out. When you're breathing out, your tummy goes in. Okay? Normally, normal practice, we do the reverse. So this conscious, this consciousness, when you're breathing in, tummy goes out. And when you're breathing out, tummy goes in. This consciousness will bring our natural breathing. That is our natural breathing. Like our small, when a small baby is uh, sleeping, you can see. When it is breathing in, your its tummy will go up. When it's breathing out, tummy goes down. So that we had forgotten during these years. And we do the breathing in wrongly. When you are breathing in, we pull our abdomen in. It's wrong. When you are breathing in, tummy goes out. When you are breathing out, your tummy goes in and it will go towards the spine. Okay? So that is what we practice. So when you are you breathing in, even our chest expands, ribcage expands. When the ribcage expands, your diaphragm also expands. That is the reason our tummy also goes out. Okay? At the same time, even the thoracic region, there will be slight difference which we will not be able to observe. But that is the reason this three-stage call, pranayama, will help you to concentrate in that particular breathing. Okay? This is called as yogic breathing, we can call. Yeah? Okay? And we all know that ujjayi breathing, you can do even lying down. This can be practiced even lying down. First, concentrating on the abdomen, then the chest, then on the thoracic area. Okay? Yeah? Okay. Now, let us start with our warm-up. Let us start with our hands. Let us roll our shoulder, shoulder joints, keeping our finger on the shoulders, bringing your elbows together. Relax, breathe in and breathe out, bring your elbows together. Breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out. Reverse, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in. Breathe out and slowly relax your hands. Now we'll do exercise for our hands. So what you're going to do here is you're going to raise your right hand, bring it towards the left shoulder blade, okay? And bring your right hand towards your right armpit, okay? Now we will do the reverse. Bring, straighten your hands. 
left hand to the right shoulder blade, right hand to the left armpit. We are going to do this alternately. Right up and left up. Right up, left up. Right up, left up. Right up, left up. One more time. Right up and left up. And then slowly relax. So why we are doing so much of shoulder exercises whenever we are doing warm-up is because normally whenever we are stressed or whenever we are having um, a lot of tension or anxiety, our stress will be concentrated on the back here, below our, below our head region. So that will get relaxed when our shoulder blades are getting relaxed. So automatically we become stress-free. Okay, that's why we need a lot of shoulder exercises to do. We need to do a lot of shoulder exercises so that physically this portion gets relaxed and automatically that will transfer for us to relax our stress. Okay, yeah. Now, now next what we will do? We will stretch our legs. We will stretch our leg. Okay, now hold at your thigh and hold it stretch. Hold your hands at your thigh and stretch it. Now try to hold at your shin, walk your hands, hold at your shin, hold at your ankle if you can. Spine should be straight. Once you are able to hold, try to hold it with one hand and stretch the other hand to the side. Look back, then bring this hand, hold, stretch the other hand, look back, then come back one more time. Right, come back. Left, come back, right, come back, left, come back, and release your right leg. Stretch your spine and touch your toes. Stretch your spine up, hands up, breathe out, touch your toes. Breathe in up, breathe out, touch your toes. Breathe in up, breathe out, touch your toes. Then come back to center. We'll do the same thing with the other leg. Left leg hold at the hold below your thighs first. Then try to hold at the shin. Then try to walk your hands up and go to the go to the ankle. See to that your knees are straight so that this is working on our hamstring. Go as much as you can. Let you let it be till the shin, but stay with your leg straight. Okay, hold and then hold it with one hand, twist. Then come back to center. Hold with the other hand, twist to the other side. Come back to center, to the right, twist. And to the left, come back to center, to the right. Come back to center, to the left. Come back to center, to the right. Then come back to center and release your legs. Now stretch your spine, stretch your spine, stretch your hands up, breathe in, breathe out, touch your toes. Breathe in up, breathe out, touch your toes. Breathe in up, breathe out, touch your toes. Then come back to center. So all our hands got engaged, right? Hand muscles got engaged and leg muscles got engaged. Okay, now let us go to Cat cow stretch. Let us relax our back and our spine. Come to come to table. Take gap between the legs. Gap between the hands. Breathe in. Arch your spine. Look up. Breathe out. Curve your spine. Chin to the collarbone. Look towards your neighbor. Breathe in. Arch your spine. Breathe out. Curve your spine. Breathe in, arch your spine. Breathe out, curve your spine. One more time. Breathe in, arch your spine. Look up. Breathe out, curve your spine. Chin to the collarbone. Look towards your navel. Then come back to center. Now let us relax our hip, hip joints by rotating. 
Rotate your hip joints. Go to the left, forward, right, back. Left, forward, right, back. Left, forward, right, back. Left, forward, right, back. Now, reverse, right, forward, left, back. Right, forward, left, back. Right, forward, left, back. Right, forward, left, and back. These are the things we can adopt when, whenever we are having any stress in our lower back because of seating, seated in, uh, seat, sitting for a long time. Okay? Now from here, stretch your right leg back and stretch it out breathing. And by breathing out, bend your right leg and try to bring your right knee towards the forehead. This is called as tiger breathing. Breathe in, leg up. Breathe out, knee to the forehead. Breathe in, leg up. Breathe out, knee to the forehead. Breathe in, leg up. Breathe out, knee to the forehead. Then come back to the center. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Stretch your leg, left leg up. Breathe in, breathe out. Bend your knees, bring to your forehead. Breathe in up, breathe out, knee to the forehead. Breathe in up, breathe out, knee to the forehead. Breathe in up, breathe out, knee to the forehead. Breathe in up, breathe out, knee to the forehead. Then come back to center. From here, go to Malasana. From here, go to Malasana. And... Just interlacing your fingers. Come on your toes and come down. Come on your toes and then come down. Come on your toes and then come down. Come on your toes and then come down. Now stretch your hands forward and then slowly straighten up and stand up. Stand up. Now take little gap between the legs. Take little gap between the legs. Little more gap, little more gap. As much as you can. Okay? Now from here, we will go to goddess pose. Stretching our legs to the sides like this. Okay? You can keep your hands like this or keep on your thighs. Okay? Now what we are going to do, stay stable here. Go to the right, go to the left. 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 Then come back to center. Yes? Yes. Now what you are going to do? Squat. Then turn to the right. Then come back to center. Squat. Then turn to the left. Come back to center. Squat. And get up. Okay? We will do it one more time. Squat. Turn to the right. Squat, turn to the left, squat, then come up. Okay, this will strengthen our legs as well as our knee joints. Now relax your legs, relax your knees. Now let us relax our legs. Okay, now just kick your legs one, two, three, four, five. Bend forward and hold. One, two, three, Four, five. Now bend backwards. Bring it. Bring your heel close to your buttocks and stay. One, two, three, four, five. And relax your leg. Now the left leg. Kick. One, two, three, four, five. Bend forward. Bring it close to your chest and stay. One, two, three, four, five. Bend back. Hold. Stay here. Bring your, bring your heel close to your buttocks and stay. One, two, three, four, five. Then come back to center. Then one more we will do for our hip joints. If you are closer to the wall, keep your one hand close to the wall and bend your leg. Hold at your knee. Hold at your knee. Take it to the side. Go back. Then come forward. Go to the side, then come forward. 
your leg position will be remaining same like this. It should be like this, holding at your thigh or your knee. Either way, you can hold, bring it forward and take it back wide. Forward, back. Forward, back. Forward, back. Release. Now we'll do the same thing with the other side. Bend. Your leg will be in this position like, yes. Now stretch back, then forward. Back, then forward. Back, then forward. Back, then forward. Then relax your legs. Now we'll relax our hip joints. Rotate. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And relax. Relax. We will do Surya Namaskar. Six set and go. Yes. Let us come to the front end of the mat. Bringing your palms together. Om Surya Namaskar. Breathe in. Raise your hands up. Arch your back. Breathe out, Padhasthasana. Breathe in, right leg back, toes stretched. Breathe out to Adho Mukha, Dhamma Dog. Breathe in to plant. Breathe out, drop your knees, chest in on the floor. Breathe in, scoop up to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha, Dhamma Dog. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padhasthasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha, downward dog. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Second round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padhasthasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padhasthasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Third round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padhasthasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padhasthasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. 
Breathe out to Hadouka. Breathe in, let's make four. Breathe out, right legs forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Fourth round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Next round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Last round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padhisthasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in to Plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. And relax. Relax, normalize your breath. Relax. So today being Thursday, today is the last day for practicing that mandala series. So let us do. I'm seeing Kavita new today for mandala series and Remy also new. Okay. So we will do, we will do as a flow. Okay. I will do, keep doing. You can also join. And we will stay there for a count of 10. By the time you will get accustomed to that pose. Yes? Ready? Yes. Breath is normalized. Take long deep breaths. And whenever I am counting 1 to 10, you can take one, at least one long deep ujjayi breath. Try to practice on one long ujjayi breath for every count, one to ten. Okay? Shall we start? Yes.
Okay. Then coming to the front end of the mat. The first pose for this series is Adho Mukha. So to go to Adho Mukha, first we arch our spine, go to Hastavutthana. Then stretch our spine, bend forward from your lower back and go to Padasasthana. And take your one leg back and the other leg back and go to Adho Mukha. So this is the first pose. Stay here and take long jets. I do the counting one to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now you raise your one leg up. When you are raising your one leg up, raise it little more. Come on your toes on your left leg. You will be able to raise it little more. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now bring your right leg forward. Right leg forward, like a split sanchalana position. Back leg toes will be stretched. Now, once you get the balance here, raise your hands above and come to Anjani Asana. Here you keep pushing your hip forward and stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now bring your hands down again to address and chalana position and lift your back leg off the mat. Eight of father, father has tarthana. In one leg, the father has tarthana. Stay here and whichever leg is go down, try to bring it straight. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now slowly bring your back leg down. Slowly bring your back leg down and bring your hands in front. Bring your hands in front and come to Skandasana. Come to Skandasana. Once you're able to get the balance, then take your hands up and bring your hands in Namaskara or put your leg down. Knees take the knee support like this and stay here. Skandasana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten. Now again, take support with your hands forward, hands down. Walk your hands towards the left. Walk your hands towards the left and turn your torso and bring your hands on either side of the left leg. Bring your hands on either side of the left leg. Okay? Now, keep your right hand down and left leg is on the ground. Raise your left hand up. Twist and pass the phone asana. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now again, come to Ashwa Sanchalana position. Come to Ashwa Sanchalana position. And now lift your legs off the mat, back leg off the mat, and come to warrior one. Come to warrior one. Look towards the left and arch your back a little. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now stretching your hands and come to warrior two. Look towards your left hand. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10. Now slide back and come to reverse warrior. Reverse warrior. Stay here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now relax your knees and turn your torso towards the left and bring your hands on either side of the either side of the leg. And take your left leg back and come to plank. Plank is a transition. Okay? 
Now we go to Chaturanga or continue to stay in plank. Go to Chaturanga and stay here or continue to stay in plank. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now scoop up to Bhujangasana and come to Urdu Mukha or stay in Bhujangasana, whichever is comfortable for you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now go to Adomukha and stay here. Adomukha will give some rest because your circulatory energy is towards the head. And stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now we will continue to the other leg. So lift your left leg off the mat, leg pada domuka, and your right leg on your toes. Lift a little more, keep pushing your head towards the mat, and stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now bring your left leg in between the hands, come to Ashwa Sanchalana position. Back leg, make your toes stretched. Okay, back leg, make your toes stretched. Now arch your back and come to Hanjaneyasana. Keep pushing your head, keep forward and arch and look up. Anjani Asana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now again, bring your hands down on either side of the leg and lift your back leg off the mat and come to Padakasana, one leg raised. Keep pushing your head towards the knee and keep raising your leg up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now drop your back leg to the ground and turn your torso, turn your torso and look forward. Once you are getting the balance, come to Skandasana. Come to Skandasana. Stay here. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now keeping your hands down, take support and start walking your hands towards the right. Walking your hands towards the right and bring your hands on either side of your right leg. Okay? Now your Left leg, left, left hand is on, onto the ground, left palm onto the ground, right leg is down, right hand up, twisted partial cone asana. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now again, bring your hands down and come to Ashwa Sanchalana position and Lift your back leg off the mat and come to warrior one. Arch your back a little, stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now stretch your hands forward and go to warrior two. Look towards your right hand. Stay here. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now go to reverse warrior. Right hand in chin mudra. Arching your back a little. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now turn your torso. Bring your hands on either side of the right leg. And take your right leg back and come to plank. Plank is the transition. Go to Chaturanga and stay. If not, stay in plank. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
सेवेन एट नाइन टेन नाउ स्कूप ऑफ बुजंग आसना एंड कम टू ऊर्जुम का ऊर्जुम का स्टेन बुजंग स्टेज है वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवेन एट नाइन टेन फ्रॉम हियर गो टू आदुम का डाउनवर्ड डॉ एंड स्टेज है वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवेन एट नाइन टेन Now drop your knees and go to child pose and relax. Relax in child pose and take long deep breaths. Once you are relaxed. then slowly come to the seated position and go to lying down position lie down on your back lie down on your back and rest in tadakasana legs are bent bend your legs and lie lie down in pond pose hands by the side of the body or take your hands above your head and bend your legs and relax and now take long deep breaths we will do abdominal breathing here breathe in abdomen up breathe out relax breathe in abdomen up breathe out relax breathe in abdomen up breathe out relax Breathe in, abdomen up. Breathe out, relax. Breathe in, abdomen up. Breathe out, relax. Now let us relax the tension in our knee joints as well as our hip joints. Okay. Now bringing your hands by the side of the body, palms facing downwards. Just lift your right leg and stretch it up. Stretch it up. Go down to ten degrees. Then come back. Bend. You are doing a side leg. Okay. Stretch ninety. Then go down to ten degrees and then come back. Bend. Stretch up. Then go down to ten degrees. Then come back. Bend. Bring it close to the chest. Stretch up. Then go down and then come back to the chest. Now do the reverse. Stretch to ten degrees. Then raise up. Then bend and bring it close to the chest. Stretch to ten degrees. Raise up to ninety. Then bend and bring close to the chest. Stretch down to ten degrees. Raise up to ninety. Then bend and bring close to your chest, and then relax your leg. Relax your right leg. You'll feel the tension in the knee joints are relaxing when you are doing this, because we are changing the circulatory energy here also. So far, we were doing warrior and troubling our knee, not troubling. We were strengthening our knee. Okay, now we'll do the same thing with the left leg. Stretch, straighten up your leg, ninety degrees. Then go down to ten degrees with the straight leg. Then bend and bring it close to your chest. Raise up to ninety degrees. Then with the straight leg go down to ten degrees. Then bend and bring it close to your chest. Raise up to ninety. Slide down to ten degrees. Then bend and bring it close to your chest. Raise up to ninety. Slide to ten degrees, then bend and bring it, bring close to the chest. Now we'll do the reverse. Straighten up to ten degrees, raise up to ninety, then bend and bring it close to the chest. Straighten up to ten degrees, raise up to ninety, then bend and bring close to the chest. Straighten up to ten degrees, 
raise up to 10, 90, bend and bring close to the chest. Straighten up to 10, 90, bend and relax your legs. Relax your legs. Relax your legs. Now we'll do the closing sequence. Bringing your hands by the side of the body. Lift your hip off the mat and come to bridge pose. Relax your hips, relax your back. Stay here. Keep pushing your hip up, up, up and stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and ten. Now slowly bring your hip down and bend your legs and bring it close to your chest and stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now slowly raise your shoulders off the mat and let us do the rocking and rolling. Rock up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Then roll to the left, come back to center, roll to the right, come back to center, roll to the left, Come back to center, roll to the right, come back to center, roll to the left, come back to center, roll to the right, come back to center, roll to the left, come back to center, roll to the right, come back to center. And slowly release your leg and stretch your legs down and stretch your hands by the side of the body at the shoulder level, palms facing upwards. Now bend your right leg, keep it over your left thigh. Push your right knee towards the left and look towards your right palm. Keep pushing and see to that your right shoulder blade, shoulders all onto the ground. Stay here, feel the nice twist in the spine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine and ten. Then slowly bring your leg back to the center and release your right leg. Bend your left leg. Keep it over your right thigh. Push your left knee towards the right and look towards your left palm. Keep pushing your right knee further. See to that your left shoulder is on the to the ground. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then slowly come back to center and relax your legs and lie down in Shavasana. Lie down in Shavasana, legs apart, toes falling outwards, hands by the side of the body, palms facing upwards, nose pointed to the ceiling, Eyes closed. Your complete weight of the body is on the mat. Take a deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Today let us do a breathing relaxation. We will breathe in, bring our abdomen up and breathe out, imprint our spine to the ground. Okay? Let us do it with reverse counting from 27 to 1. Breathe in, abdomen up. Breathe out, relax. 27. Breathe in, abdomen up. Breathe out, relax. 26. Breathe in, abdomen up. Breathe out, relax, 25. Breathe in, abdomen up. Breathe out, relax, 24. Breathe in, abdomen up. Breathe out, relax, 23. Breathe in, abdomen up. 
Breathe out, relax, 22. Breathe in, abdomen up. Breathe out, relax, 21. Now onwards, do the counting mentally and do the abdominal breathing on your own. Keep counting, keep doing. Stop the counting wherever you are. It's okay. And just relax. Normal breathing. Just relax in stillness and silence. Just for one minute, let us stay in silence. Body is totally relaxed. Become aware of your surroundings and start slow movements. Start wiggling your toes, wiggle your fingers. Stretch your legs down and stretch your hands up and stretch your spine nicely. And then slowly roll over to your right side. And whenever you're feeling comfortable with the support of the left hand, slowly sit up. Slowly sit up. Slowly sit up with your eyes closed. In this calm state of mind, let us pray and bless this whole world, bringing your palms together. Oh, Bhavan. To Sukinaha Serve Santo Niramaya Serve Badrani Pashantu Ma Kachetu Kababa Vet O Shanti 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 He Slowly rub your palms, generate heat. Rub it on your eyes. Feel the warmth. Feel the energy. Now slowly looking through the gaps of the fingers. Open your eyes with a beautiful smile. So how was it? Yeah? Particularly for 